Hey guys, Super Vampire here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today I have a quick question for you guys. Um, have you ever wanted a cape like this, or maybe an HD skin like this? Well, now using the HD skins mod, you can, and it can be downloaded uh, two ways. So make sure to watch the whole video. And yeah, so be right back in a second. See ya. Oh. Okay, so hey guys, I'm back in the internet browser, and I will show you how to set it as your skin. Okay, so, well, this is where, where you will go once you follow the first link, Minecraft HD Skins News, whatever. So, what you need to do is you basically need to sign up for it, and once you sign up, you can go to a thing called Skin Manager. And, uh, this is basically where you set your skins and everything, but before that, we'll go to Downloads. Um, then we go to Mod, Current. There's two downloads, this one and this one. This one did not work for me, but this one did, so I'm going to go ahead and download this one for you guys. Um, right there. Okay, so if we want to download this one right now, we can go into this and we type percent app data percent. Enter that in, and we will get roaming.minecraft bin, and then we go open with winwar archiver. And once is this open, you just open up this also. Just give me both. Wait, 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 just okay. Anyway, so just put this and just drag it into here. So I'm not gonna do it since I already have it installed. But uh, I promise you, that's all you have to do. It's super simple. It's really easy, and you guys can do it super fast. All right. So I'm just gonna keep that up for now and. Uh, to actually pick your skins, like, you see I have, like, all of these skins, all, you know, chosen, all of these, so what you need to do is you need to go to this one, second link, um, there's more links like this, but I found this one the best, uh, so he has multiple skins, as you can see, just, like, all the ones that I have, um, but I'm gonna download, uh, I'm just gonna download, uh, choose Pigman, okay, so all you have to do is click on it, and it will so send you to add fly and you just gotta wait five seconds new like no no I don't want my I don't want an iPhone 5 I'm good with the phone I have right now so it'll redirect you and all you have to do is click download on this and it downloads it right for you I do not want the pop-up so let me just go back to so we're back in that and we got HD pigman.zip so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go upload file and this is if you want it on multiplayer and single player uh, so all you have to do is do choose file and I guess I can go to downloads and then choose um, wherever this thing is oh oh sorry I gotta put this okay I gotta put gotta open up a new one and I gotta go to um, documents just download oh my god okay this is turning out to be more difficult than I thought it would oh right so if you open that up all you need is this pig zombie dot png so let me just make this smaller um, Wow that was laggy so let me just drop pigman onto my desktop we can exit out of that now put this back up choose file go to desktop okay there we are. desktop then we go down to the bottom, pigzombie.png, open this up, and I'll just name it P-I-G-Z-O-M-B-I-E, pig zombo, zombie, there we go. So after that's done, you can just put a description if you make your own, because there's a template and everything. So if you make your own, you know, just like put a description on it, and if it's a skin, click skin, if it's a cape, click escape, but it's a skin, private shared, it's private because only I'm going to use it, so I'm going to upload this image. And once the image has uploaded in a couple seconds, go click here to continue. So, shut up, dog. Sorry, that dog was barking. Anyway, so it's probably at the bottom. And uh, unfortunately, this isn't going to work for me because I have uh, another one at my house. But, I mean, another thing, like I have it logged in on another account right now. So I can't really show you guys, but it would pop up right here. And if you don't want to wear either, just click disable and it'll disable it for you right away but yeah the pig zombie is going to be on uh, when I go back into Minecraft hopefully cross my fingers uh, but this was the first way um, and this is probably the best way to do it if you're going to do it do it this way trust me 
Um, um, the reason why this is the best way is because like it works on multiply, mul multiply, multiplayer and single player. So it's like really good. Okay, I joined the game F1, F5, and look at me. I'm a pig zombie. Okay, so there we go. My pig zombie works. Uh, even though it didn't show up in my actual browser, it works. So even if we do F1, look at my ew, gross, veiny. Okay, whatever. I'm out of here. Um, and we can also go on the single player HD skins. And let's look at my guy. Yes, it is the pig zombie. So it works, guys. And um, I'll just show you the other way. It's not gonna like work for this because I don't have my I don't have it set at the Steve skin. But I'll show you anyway. So I'll just save and quit to the title. Exit out of here. So we're gonna have to bring up our Minecraft again. So I can just press back. Oh, I already have it up in WinRAR. Hmm, thought ahead. That's a first. Uh, you want to go into mob and you you want to see this charred up PNG. You want to delete this and put yours in and rename it whatever you want. Like if it's Doom, if it's whatever, just rename it C H A R dot PNG. And if you want to put a cape in, put C A P E dot PNG. And that will work for single player. I don't see why you just do it for single player, but hey, it's not my choice. So um yeah. I'll put these two links in the description, but I hope you guys have found this video helpful. If you have, uh, please feel free to leave it with a like or a comment. Uh, yeah, so hope you guys are having a great day, and I will talk to you guys later.